Right, hello guys, it's uh, DJ Ferntree here with a gig log for you. Just thought I wasn't going to do one, but I thought I'd better do, just so you all know I'm alive. Uh, this is the first gig log in, I don't know when the last one was, might have even been December, so seven months. Uh, but yeah, I'm alive, here I am in the flesh. Uh, it's been a busy year, um, second year of architecture, so I've been flat out with that. And then there was the brother's wedding, been rammed with hotel bookings. Um, so yeah, I've just not had the time. Um, and today, I do have a time, one second, let me check what the time is. It's 20 past 6, I'm at the venue, and I start at half past 7, and I've got a half an hour set up, so yeah, I'm an hour and 10 minutes early, before I can even get into the room. Um, really didn't think that one through. Whoops. Uh, anyway, lovely venue, just to give you a bit of an overview, we are at the Huntsman Inn, which is over the top end of Home Firth, so I'll give you a view out from my car right now. Uh, so we're looking right across the Mars. So in that direction, Huddersfield, behind that fence. And then over there, where the horrible clouds are, as you would expect from Lancashire, is Manchester. Um, so, we've got a wedding tonight. It's... I'm gonna ignore the focus, I'm probably going to be blurry now. It's not one of my own bookings. Well, it is. It's a DJ um, who own... Well, he's... He manages 11 other DJs, he's got a load of venues. So he's basically in charge of residencies at a load of uh, hotels and he's contacted me because he's not got enough DJs to cover this one. Um, so we've got a special rate going, so I'm kind of like one of his backup ones. So it's the first time I've done one for him, so hopefully it goes alright. We've got a bride and groom, obviously. Uh, groom is French and that's pretty much all I know. Um, so hopefully next shot I'll be all set up and ready to rumble. Right, well, it's now 10 past 7, so I've been here for 55 minutes. I'm, I'm losing the will to live slightly. Um, being in, they're not quite ready yet. Went in about 15 minutes ago and they were just about to clear desserts and then move on to speeches. So, yeah, I thought I'd share my suffering with you all. So, uh, while I'm here, in the van, might as well do the equipment check. So, at the front, the Gubbins ends, we have got two Alto two Sonic 112As. Uh, behind that, we've got one of my little Wharfdale 12 inch actives, um, lighting box, sound box. Uh, I've actually got my dual CD player, not the uh, CDJs. Um, two LED dots, lights, um, and then CDs, microphones. Under there, there is my LED cam party bar. So, yeah, it's uh, a bit smaller than the usual setup um, because I've only got half an hour to set it up inside where I'm in, well, no, if I do get in. Um, so therefore I can't DMX and stuff like that because it just it does take time, especially if there's something goes wrong um, It's nice to have a bit of time to fix it. So it usually, usually takes me about 45 minutes if I'm doing that setup uh, With the two movers and scanners uh, obviously a lot longer if I've got the truss um, So therefore I've had to back step for this one um, So hopefully next shot I'll be inside and set up um, I'll probably have grey hair at this rate, but we'll see so yeah, I was meant to have uh, actually just started, um, but I'm still in the car, still not loaded in, I'm still doing speeches. Right, we've got a 10 minute update, really exciting stuff, I'm going to reveal what's happening. I'm still in the car. Turns out cars are really, really boring when you're not driving them. Yep, yeah, I'm still in the car, I'm questioning my sanity. So I've made sure I had a couple of French songs in and uh, they were really good actually. 
Uh, it fizzled out towards the end, last two or three songs, no one was really up, which is kind of odd, considering they've been up all night. Um, but yeah, other than that, really good night. Um, so, new venue for me, staff were all great, um, really helpful. So, you never know, I might be there again, might not. And it would seem like my tea is ready, so I'm going to leave it there. <laughs> so yeah, I know it's not being the best gig vlog in the world, um, especially equipment wise, but I just thought I'd show you what it's like. Um, so I mean, I've been flat out on Friday, I had a, uh, well Wednesday I had a school disco, Friday I had a kids party for a uh, guy in screw. Today obviously a wedding, so it's that a wedding. Tomorrow I've got a kids party, and on Monday I've got a school disco as well, so I'm absolutely flat out at the moment. Anyway, Thanks very much for watching, any comments sticking below, uh, please like and subscribe and I shall see you next time.